Welcome to BMAC Inventory Management System IMS How To Video Tutorial. This video will educate you on how to upload products on BMAC IMS Web. Before uploading products, you should create company's name, locations, and units of measurement from the settings module. From the landing page, step one, click on store for options available. Step two, click on product. Step three, click on upload products from Excel. Step four, click on download template. Step five, open the downloaded template and populate it with the following company's inventory data. Product name, compulsory field. Display name, compulsory field. Product code, for barcode users, you can scan the code here. Units of measurement, compulsory field. Size, weight, height, width, color. Parent category, for example, drinks. Sub category, for example, soft drinks, molds. Manufacturer, cost of product, compulsory field. Markup, selling price of the product. Production date, best before date. This is useful to keep track of expiry dates of inventory. Ensure your spreadsheet format is set at text and takes the format of date, month, and year. Location quantity, compulsory field, based on the quantity you arrived at. Location name, compulsory field. Ideal quantity is the normal stock level or EQQ you want to keep in each location. Minimum quantity is the stock level at which you don't go below. Maximum quantity is the stock level at which you don't want to go above. Warning quantity is the stock level at which you want the system to notify you for reorder. Variant name, name of various fractions you sell a product, for example, dozen, crates, should be separated with comma and the spreadsheet format should be in text format. Variant units, the quantity in each variant, for example, 12, 24, should be separated with comma and the spreadsheet format should be in text format. Variant price, the price of each fraction, for example, 25,000, 4,000, should be separated with commas and the spreadsheet format should be in text format. When we have the same product in a different location, we repeat the same process on a different row. Six, save the populated template on your computer. Seven, click the browse button to select the file. Eight, click the upload product button to finish the upload. Thank you for taking time out to watch this video. Please practice this a couple of times to master this process.